My name is Talia, my pronouns are she slash her, I am 21 from North London and a cool fact about me is that I listen to a song and decide what colour it is and then put that song into a coloured playlist. So whenever I'm feeling a certain colour or a certain mood, I'll just put that playlist on. So for example, I have a lime green playlist, which seems to be full of lots of funky jazz. So yeah, and I hope you enjoy my submission. What are you so afraid of, you two? You are, aren't you? You're afraid of something. Are you afraid that someone will be able to look after Tom as well as you do? Or better? Is that it? It is, isn't it? You want to be the only ones, the holy ones, dedicated angels. You make me sick. You smooth the bed. You hang flowered wallpaper in his room. You feed him mush when the doctors told you years ago to let him chew. No, I'm angry because you leave him in there while you watch TV in here. Because all he ever gets for Christmas is a pair of socks. Oh, one year, a towel. A towel wrapped up in all Santa Claus paper. But most of all, I'm angry because you never, ever kiss him. I've never seen you kiss him. In all the years, never. Oh yeah, now not so much that he's a grown man, but then. I remember kissing him. How I used to sneak into his room and slide into his bed and whisper silly jokes and childish stories. We grew up together, but I got all the kisses. And he got what? Soapy flannels. Passive exercises. Yes, he needed those things, but not only. Not only. How could you not kiss him? His soft sleeping body. His long, thin limbs. The cover his eyelashes against his bed-warm cheeks. For Christ's sake, Mum, whatever happened to him, it happened inside of you. That should draw you together, shouldn't it? You know, he looks at you as if you were a god. A shining, breathtaking god. You know that, don't you? I would love to be a part of the National Youth Theatre Company because I have always wanted to pursue acting and now I've finished uni, I feel like it's the perfect time for me to get really involved in something that's incredibly collaborative and I can add some more experience to my CV. Um, I really thrive in a collaborative environment. I love working with people. I'm a people person um, and I would just love the opportunity to act more. I went to university and I was part of the Musical Theatre Society, but it was during the pandemic, so I only really got a year and a bit of acting there. So I'm absolutely desperate to get stuck in again. Other than acting, my other passion is art. I did art and design at university. And now as a little side hustle, I have a small printing business where I sell and create funky art prints. And I do stuff like this. And this is a self-portrait as part of a project that I did about animal symbolism. And it's a swan because I think that I share similar attributes to a black swan. I won't explain why. A time where I had a positive impact on someone was during a lockdown. I can't remember which one it was, they all merge into one, but I was on a drive to go for a walk with one of my housemates and we were singing along to Holding On by Wilson Phillips from the Bridesmaids film really loudly in the car and we came to a roundabout and the guy in the van next to me rolled down his window and asked me to roll down mine and said I haven't seen someone smile or have so much fun in so long so thank you and then just drove off so I think we had a good impact on his day